Hello everyone, a student field trip interrupted today by calls for help. A man stuck in the Rio Grande, possibly for days. Lucky for him, the students heard his cries and called 911. And what followed was a dramatic rescue that was caught on tape. News 13, Selena Westervelt is live in the Newsplex. Selena. Tim, the city's fire department and police were called to rescue the man this morning. He was stuck in thick mud and water, and it took rescuers more than an hour to pull him out of the river. Our cameras were rolling as Clayton Sen was pulled out of the Rio Grande. It's this group of AP biology students at La Cueva High School who found the man. They were studying the Oxbow open space near St. Pius when they heard him calling out for help. They say he was asking for water, sounded disoriented, and told them he couldn't feel his legs. Realizing the man was trapped in the river, they called police. Now, rescuers used an air bowl and pulley system to drag him out of the river. They say he was stranded on a reed island about 100 yards from the river's bank. He's stating he was out there for five days. There's no way to verify that, but uh, he was extremely cold. We, brought, we had to bring out some uh, blankets to him and some hot packs to try to initiate some warming procedures to him. Now we're told the man Clayton Sen is a transient who had been living by the river. He has been treated for hype, minor, hype, minor hypothermia, but is expected to be okay. And tonight at 10, Tim, we'll hear from the students and teacher credited with saving his life. Thank you, Selena. Sen is undergoing treatment at UNM Hospital, but when he gets out of there, his troubles will not be over. Also tonight at 10, why his next trip might be a trip to jail.